What is up guys, it's Tom here and welcome to the Liverpool Watford Premier League preview and prediction video. What is your prediction? What is your score prediction for the Liverpool Watford game? It's a huge game for Liverpool. Liverpool can go top of the league with a victory here because Man City amazingly dropped points against Middlesbrough yesterday. I was so happy about that result. So let me know what is your prediction and also who will be the who will be the goal scorers. And I will predict just for fun the Liverpool starting eleven. There are maybe rumors that Emre Can and Vina Dun was a sick during the week and they haven't trained for a couple of days. But there are also rumors that they will be fit and available. Um, and I'm guessing that they will be. So my starting eleven: Karius, Klein, Lovren, Matip, and James Milner comes back into the starting lineup. He was sick last week, so he didn't play. But Moreno did okay. Lalan Anderson and Vinaldo in, in midfield with Firmino, Mane and Coutinho up front so Sturridge has to make do with a spot on the bench again and uh, hopefully uh, Chan and Vinadum can play but if they can't play then what I think Jurgen Klopp will do is bring Coutinho back into midfield and uh, push um, Sturridge into the starting lineup or maybe Origi but Sturridge is more, more, more likely and this won't be an easy game. On paper, you know, Liverpool Watford, you would think that uh, it should be an easy pre free points, but that's not the case in the Premier League. And this is why we love this league so much. Just take a look at the recent performances of Middlesbrough, a newly promoted side. They went to Arsenal, they got a draw. They went to Man City, they got battered the whole game, but Man City didn't take most of their chances. And they got a draw in the last minute, which is brilliant for Liverpool and for other teams challenging for the title. Walter Marzari came in to, uh, from Italy, a uh, new manager, and uh, he never managed outside of Italy, but he's doing fantastically well so far at Watford. They sit in seventh place. They are deploying a 3-5-2 or 5-3-2 uh, system. Odiono Gallo, who at this stage last season had seven goals, only has one goal. But uh, the, the amazing stat that I have for you guys is that Watford had only four shots on target in the last three games uh, and they won uh, two of those. Two of those uh, games were won by Watford and one of those games they didn't even have a shot on target and they won with an own goal. And they kept three consecutive clean sheets. So this will be a very, very tough game. I don't think that uh, Liverpool will score a lot of goals here. Even though Liverpool are the, the joint top scorers in the Premier League before this game week began. Now it's Chelsea because they smashed Everton 5-0. By the way, what a result that is. Chelsea, five clean sheets in a row, five victories. So they are right back into the title race. And Liverpool have to, keep, have to keep winning, have to win these kind of games to challenge for the title. So this will be another big test. And Watford's defense is rock solid this season. They conceded less goals than Liverpool and that says it all and um, and I think Liverpool we have to be very patient but I also hope that we start very very attackingly just like against West Brom and get an early lead because if, can, if we can score early Watford's game plan might change and they might come out a little bit which will result in a little bit more space in behind but yeah Watford with this 5-3-2 system will be very difficult to break down because they will flog the midfield but uh, also they have two strikers Dini and Igalo who try to press from the front so Liverpool we have to be careful at the back not to pass it around too much not to risk anything um, so this is a huge test for Liverpool and I'm really excited really looking forward to it because Liverpool are a much much better team under Jurgen Klopp now than last season and last season we won this game a routine 2-0 victory at Anfield but against Watford, at Watford, we lost 3-0 in one of the worst games of the season. I still have nightmares about that game. So I hope that Liverpool can win this game really, really pumped. And we, uh, we are a better team than Watford, but we have to show on the pitch every week. And hopefully our defense will be better. As you can see, Watford don't have a lot of shots on target, just four shots on target in the last three games. But Liverpool, as you know, from the statistics, don't uh, 
they don't need to concede a goal with a lot of shots on target. They they have, uh, I think, the one of the worst rates in the Premier League in terms of goals to shots on target ratio. So Liverpool, even with one shot on target, you can score against Liverpool. So yeah, I'm, I'm just a little bit nervous, but also excited about this game. So let me know what do you think, what will be the result, and smash the like button if you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching. See you later, guys. Goodbye.